smarmy, smuggy grin on the chops of the greatest. I'll tell you what, there's a lot of relief behind that grin because uh, Barney's had the darts to win this particular set against the throw, and um, we may well look back on this set as the one where the opportunity to level up the sets uh, has gone. Perfect for the normal tier there. Tell me the side, Johnny, left or right? Cover. One oh, magic cover! Well, some people say that us two do hype. We don't do hype, we do life, boy. You couldn't hype this more, John. It's coming true. Virtual hype, never. I'm not the type to hype. When I see a Barney storming 180. I like it. Needs the under zipper. Now 65. Take the set. If he takes this leg, vital visit, 140 meters here. Once again, Barnevelt on 156. If he'd have taken that out in the previous leg, and he came so, so close, the width of the wire away, it would be he now throwing for the set. As it is, he's throwing to save it. Superb second dart. Wow! Just cranks up there. Dart to dart this. 124 for 5-3. 18 leaves the red berry. Not going to pop in the ball. So double eight for Barnevelt. With two legs all in this crucial eight set. Taylor led three sets to nil. Barnevelt has fought back brilliantly, but he needs this. Absolutely imperative. He gets it third dart this time. And he has his shot. Beautiful use of two lines there. Just look where he put this one, folks. Magic. Sydney, Barnevelt is hit a 180 in all four legs in this set. And he'd give anything now to have another one. He really does need one. Well, all the more now. Because Taylor, with throw, is favourite to take this leg and with it the set. Phenomenal average. Taylor started with 112 first set. Barney could only manage 83. Now look at the averages. Fantastic. Locked together. 100.7 plus 100.9. And that could get better. Yes, it could. And if it does, of course, then we'll start comparing it with that incredible final of 1996 when Taylor beat uh, Priestley in, in what I consider to be the best darts match I've ever seen. That was here. Circus Tavern. Barney has to try the under dipper here. Oh, went to the extreme corner. Sensational. One oh, magic has two darts. Look at the use of the lie. Went through the fight. It's your heart out, Houdini. Who needs Vaseline? Oh, nice. crucial last start, that one. Absolutely crucial. Even though he's on a bogey there, 166, he needed it. He needed it, and Barney could do with a treble here. And another one will put him in with a chance. Magic second dart by Barney to the corner again. For the third time in this set, Barnevelt has left himself 1-5-6. One time, it's going to well. Right, the fun will happen if Taylor leaves a one dart there. But we're looking at a level game, Johnny. Well, it'll be a level game in all respects because it'll be effectively then a best of five set if Barnevelt can take out 156 here. Oh, what a pity he couldn't put that in. 23, 43, 113 left. Taylor for the set, then Sid. And the last minute last, if Barney does get back to the board. Here we go then. 
to go two sets away from the World Championship. Phil Taylor looks at 60. Double four, four, five, three in sets. Double two. Yes. So there you have it. Phil Taylor knows that Phil was an absolutely Taylor. crucial set. It was a ding dong one and it went to him by three legs to two. And he leads now. Well, by five sets to three. Ding dong! Welcome back, folks, to a very topsy turvy great final. Taylor said, off as though the house was on fire. Barney tried to get back in the blue of Barney's. Didn't do that till the middle of the game. Then Taylor White in 107. Barney 105. And then Taylor won a jump with a shorter average. Yes, that can happen. They had more darts at the double and therefore. Uh, had an inferior average, if you can call 104 to 106 inferior. Uh, it tells me is that it is a, a remarkable standard of darts that we're seeing now. And um, both of these men now so deep into this contest, we saw Taylor uh, dip in terms of his uh, quality, his form for a short time, but he was inev inevitably going to come out of it. Uh, stack great use of the stacking dog with a bit of flight. I remind you, he's come on in the last uh, 12 months, this kid, being sharpened by 16. the likes of Billy against the likes of Martin and the lads and Lloyd. Um, a year ago, he couldn't handle Klassen, even though he had a higher average. He was averaging 93 to Klassen's 89 and let Klassen beat him in the BDL final. He's now, though, snidgily ahead, John, in this averages. 100.7 body. It's 100.6 TLA. The Circus Tavern, a very special place and uh, completely full tonight. As it has been for most of this wonderful tournament. But final night, always a rare occasion. And my, these two men are making the most of it. Well, thank you. One hundred. Thanks to my professional masseur, Sam McCarth. They're very good for holding me out with the old shoulders this morning. It's great when you have to start getting massaged when you're only 63, John. <laughs> one I'll, wait. I'll wait another 25 years then, Sid, as uh, Taylor looks at 142 Barnevelt on a finish Taylor on a finish 82 left is he going to go bull is he going to go treble 14 he goes the bull double 16 for a killer for a killer oh, no! yeah. he looks remarkably calm here Barnevelt but he must have thought for a moment this is it Double six, likes double six, quarter past the hour. There it is, no problem. Second leg is filled to throw first.